All around the world, including right here in Kelloland, people are remembering the fall of the Berlin Wall. 30 years ago, that historic event has come to symbolize the unification of East and West Germany, as well as the end of the Cold War. Today, the South Dakota Synod commemorated that moment in 1989 by contextualizing it to walls that might exist in 2019. Kelloland's Lauren Solick brings you that story from the Chapel of Reconciliation on the Augustana University campus in Sioux Falls. We need to be cautious about all the walls that we built in our own mind, around our homes, around our countries, around um, any ideology that we have that this is the only way how the world can be viewed. South Dakota Synod Bishop Constanza Hagmeyer grew up in West Germany and saw the fall of the Berlin Wall when she was 19 years old. Today, she shared her story with the congregation and spoke about how we can break down the walls that still exist today. It was a peaceful revolution then and I, I hope that we as people of this world um, continue to um, stand up for these peaceful revolutions of tearing down walls that surround us no matter where they are whether they're physical walls or walls in our hearts or our minds. Hugo Rodriguez a member of Pueblo de Dios in Sioux Falls was another speaker at the event. He spoke about the metaphorical walls immigrants face coming to a new country. Once we arrived to the U.S. or in any country in the world for immigrants can be very difficult because we then face other walls. Rodriguez says those walls could be language barriers, the struggle of making new friends, or the difficulties of getting a job. And it doesn't have to be a brick wall. It's just those barriers that we build just by judging others. Bishop Hagmeyer says one way the world can begin tearing down those walls is just by talking with one another. When you have an opportunity to sit down with someone that you thought um, you would never be able to sit down with for whatever reason, make an attempt to sit down and hear their story and share your story. It starts breaking down walls. Once we uh, bring those walls down, I'm sure we can make this a better place. In Sioux Falls, Lauren Solick. Kelloland News.